If your water breaks, this can look a number of different ways. It's probably not like the movies uh, where the water breaks and she's rushing down to the hospital, the baby's almost falling out. Or if you've ever seen the Coneheads episode with when her water breaks and they're all standing in six inches of water, uh, that's likely not gonna be your experience either. Um, sometimes it is a big gush and sometimes it's just a trickle. So um, you might think about having some pads on hand towards the end of pregnancy or it depends. That's a lot of time even easier than um, using a big bulky pad. So it's really up to you whatever you are more comfortable with. Now contractions may start and they may not, and both are pretty normal. Uh, you might touch, touch base with your care provider and find out exactly what he or she wants you to do if your water breaks. Uh, but I, it's kind of nice to know that, that um, sometimes it is a few hours before contractions start. Your body will keep replenishing amniotic fluid. You will likely keep leaking. And, um, but at the, in the same, by the same token, you can also drink water, and uh, that will help keep those fluid levels up.